Well, howdy, friends. Brian Fleshig of Mad River Outfitters in the Midwest Fly Fishing Schools, and welcome back here to the Mad River Outfitters YouTube channel. I uh, wanted to take just a few minutes today to reintroduce to you a brand of fly tying, basically storage and organization systems from our good friend Rick Weisberg at Oasis Fly Tying Benches. Now, for years we've kind of carried Rick's stuff off and on, but we only had a few of the popular pieces. Um, he got busy, we got busy, we kind of lost touch. Um, and in the meantime, Rick really trimmed back the number of stores and fly shops that he was working with. But I am here today and very proud to announce that Mad River Outfitters is now one of only three premium specialty fly shops in the country that you will find uh, Rick's Oasis Fly Tying Benches. Uh, he no longer works with the big box stores and there's only three of us fly shops in the country where you find this stuff. So, and we've pretty much got it all, uh, everything out there. And I just wanted to give you a quick overview of some of his stuff. Uh, for example, it's all handmade by Rick and his assistant, Joe. Uh, so they are, in other words, busy guys and very good at woodworking, to say the least. But they've designed a variety of different uh, storage systems and organizational systems for fly tires that are extremely well made, extremely well thought out. Their attention to detail is second to none. And uh, it's just a real honor for us to sell their stuff. So thanks, Rick and Joe for everything you do and thanks Rick for taking Mad River Outfitters back under your wing and making us one of those three prestigious dealers. Uh, but just some of the highlights uh, and of course stay tuned because we're going to be taking a look at each one of these individual products in the weeks and months to come in videos to give you a, a better look at each. But two of his most popular items is this thread rack. Uh, for those of you that tie flies and you've got thread laying all over the place, the thread rack, it's not very expensive and I forget exactly how many tune into the video on the thread rack. I'll tell you how many slots that has for thread. And then of course the Lazy Susan. The Lazy Susan is a fantastic way to store all your bobbins, your scissors. It's got spots for all your UVs, your lights, your glues. Pretty much everything you need as far as your tools can be stored on that Lazy Susan right there. Uh, another little thing, I've been using this one, it's called the Midge Bench. It's just got a, you know, spots for some scissors, some bobbin, some glues, and then a little rounded space here for hooks and beads. Um, he's even got a little, uh, what is this called? This is called the Fly Dock with a base. Um, it's got a couple magnets there, and then you can uh, put flies in there to let them dry. You've got your hook and bead storage center. You can store a variety of different beads. Hooks right there, that's pretty cool. Here's the Hook Hotel. The Hook Hotel is exactly that. Get your hook boxes out. You can label them as to what you have. A great way to store your hooks. Here's the Sparkle Spinner. I think that's what it's called. Yes, the Sparkle Spinner. This is the, I think the 32 version. And again, for those of you that work with um, Crystal Flash, Flashaboo, all those different materials, uh, it's an easy way to store um, these things, prevent them from getting all tangled up and getting into a mess. There's two different versions of this, the 16 and the 32 slot. And then also kind of really his claim to fame is these uh, benches. And these benches are absolutely beautiful. For those of you that may not have a dedicated fly tying bench, uh, for example, this is, I think this is the Walnut Compact Bench. And uh, I'm telling you friends, this thing is absolutely beautiful. In fact, I think uh, you'll see me doing some fly tying on this one um, just because it's gorgeous. It's so well made. It's got a spot you can clamp a vise on here or get your pedestal vise in here. Tons of spaces for all your tools. Uh, materials, uh, cements and things like that, easily transportable. Um, I think this one over here is called the Fly Factory, if I'm not mistaken, and uh, just a slightly smaller version of it and uh, kind of more designed for just 
holding your uh, scissors and tools and cements and beads and glues and all kinds of stuff. Uh, doesn't really have a place to put a vise on. Another one that uh, is very popular, I don't have on the table here, is the pedestal base. And the pedestal base is just a small, inexpensive uh, base where you can put some tools, you can clamp a vise onto, or your pedestal sits right on top of it. You can, and that way you can just go from room to room, kitchen, living room, dining room, uh, you know, wherever you want to tie flies, just pick it up and go. And that's one of the more popular and um, uh, inexpensive accessories from Rick and the folks at Oasis. So, like I said, friends, just wanted to make an announcement and get the word out about Oasis. I'm sure that there's a link to the entire lineup of Oasis products right below me. If you click that, it'll take you to our website where you can see pictures and descriptions and all this stuff. But stay tuned. We're going to be taking a look at each one of these individually and take a look at the features, the benefits, um, the construction of each and every one of them over the coming months. Uh, but again, it's a real honor. Thanks again, Rick and Joe, for everything you do. Uh, beautiful, beautiful work. Proud to be vendors for Oasis Fly Tying Benches here at Matter for Outfitters. As always, friends, stay tuned. Subscribe if you like what we do. Be sure to hit that like button and stay tuned. We've got a lot more coming at you. If you like this video, hit subscribe. It helps out a lot. And check out these videos. We think you might like them too.